All right, guys, this is the second video for the solo in um, Led Zeppelin's Stairway to Heaven. Um, and uh, again, remember, um, if this one gets on YouTube, the rest of the videos uh, you can find at www.mikesguitarlessons.com. And uh, that's going to be up in mid-October of 2008. So um, check that out if you um, are interested. Now, let's get to it. We've already completed our first phrase in video one. And we started on our second one. Okay, so our second one, the part that we've gotten through so far, and you'll watch the first video before this one in case uh, you get mixed up because you don't want to be lost. So our uh, phrase that we're on right now, and the notes we've already learned, uh, we've gotten this far. Okay, now. After this 12th fret on the G, the note we ended on in the last video, you're going to use your first finger to play the 10th fret on the B. Okay, 10th fret on the B. And then you're going to play the 13th fret on the B. Use your third finger or your pinky to do it. Then you're going to play 10th fret on the E string. That's the skinniest one. Okay, then back to 13th on the B with your third finger and then you're going to uh, actually move down here change positions and you're going to put your third finger on the tenth fret even though it seems like first would be a good idea you've got to do a pull off to the eighth fret so the next note is going to be tenth fret on the B string with your third finger pluck that note and then pull off to the uh, eighth fret of the B string okay remember you don't re-pluck it for a pull off you just pluck the note once and then pull off your finger to make the next note come out. Okay, now after that you're going to play 10th fret on the G string. And this is the last note of this phrase. You're going to start on the 8th fret of the B string, pluck that note, and slide up to this 10th fret. Okay, so that's what that should sound like. Let me go through that whole second phrase now for you. So here we go. Okay, now that was the second phrase. Um, it's probably a good idea for me to go over that again. Let me just play it slow for you one more time. Um, play with me slowly, and then as you get comfortable and you memorize it, go ahead and speed it up a little bit. Um, but you want to make sure you play it cleanly before you go fast. So here it is, slow again, um, starting at the beginning of the second phrase. So here we go. Okay, so that's the second phrase of the solo. Now, um, we're going to go to the third one now, and this one's really similar actually to the first one. So um, let's go ahead and get to that one. You're going to come back down here to this position. This is fifth fret, this is seventh, this is ninth, so you know where we're at. Um, so we're going to go down here to the third uh, finger, is going to, or your third finger is going to play the seventh fret. In the on the uh, G string, okay. So it's going to be playing this note again. Now remember, um, if you bend, you've got to have these fingers back uh, behind your uh, third finger. So go ahead and put those there, and we're going to bend again. But this time we don't vibrato at the top. We just bend it, okay. And you don't hear these. At least I don't hear these notes coming back down when I listen to the solo. So I just kill that note at the top, and then touch the string with my right uh, palm of my hand so it, it just kills the note like that okay so bend that note up a whole step remember seventh fret G string okay then we're gonna go to the fifth fret 
on the E string with our first finger. Okay, then eighth fret on the B string. This is real similar to the last one, but it changes eventually. So eighth fret on the B string. Okay, fifth fret on the B string with your first finger. Seventh fret on the G string with your third finger. Okay, fifth fret on the G string with your first finger. And seventh fret on the D string with your third finger. Okay, let's go through that again. We're not through with the phrase, but I want to go ahead and go through it again. So, seventh fret bend on the G string. And then we walk down the pentatonic scale. Five on the E, eight on the B, five on the B, seven on the G, five on the G, seven on the D. Okay, that's where we stopped. Now we're going to keep going here. And again, you just use this finger to play seventh fret on the D string, and now we're going to seventh fret on the G string. So I don't want you to pick it up and put it back down. I want you to just roll back and lay your finger across that note. So you play that D string and then roll your finger back to go over the seventh fret of the G string and that way you can play that note quickly without any pause there okay so seventh fret on the G um, five, fifth fret on the G then seventh fret on the D again fifth fret on the D seventh fret on the A we're going to go back up here to 5th fret on the D, and then 7th fret on the D, then 5th fret on the G, then 7th fret on the D. Did, did I say, I'm not sure what I said there. That was 5th fret on the G, okay? And now we're to 5th fret on the, uh, I'm sorry, 7th fret on the D. And then 5th fret two times on the G. And then the last uh, part of this section of this phrase is going to be 5th to 3rd on the D string. So go to 3rd fret, I'm sorry, the 5th fret on the D string, and I use my first finger. Pluck that note and slide back to the 3rd fret. Okay? Let's go through all that again because that, that's quite a few notes. All right. The beginning of this third phrase. So here it goes. Seventh fret on the G, then five on the E, eight on the B, five on the B, seven on the G, five on the G, seven on the D, roll back to seven on the G, five on the G, seven on the D, Five on the D, seven on the A, five on the D, seven on the D, five on the G, seven on the D, five on the G, then another one, and now go over, still use your first finger here. 5 on the D string and slide to the 3rd fret. Okay? The riff is not over there, the phrase is not over there, but that's a good um, stopping point to try to memorize. Okay, so let's go through it again. Still slow. your first finger. Okay, let's do it one more time. Okay, and um, that'll do it for the third, or let me see, the second video for the Stairway to Heaven's, um, the solo in Stairway to Heaven by Led Zeppelin. Um, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Work hard on that and look uh, to video number three when you're done with this one.